Hey Nation Pixels here and I got a video for you guys. It says IGN won't release Call of Duty Advanced Warfare review until incident is revolved. So what I got from this article is either IGN is getting paid to make reviews or something like that. Uh, it's pretty much saying that a check bounce. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and read exactly what it said. The general manager at IGN said, we had the review ready for about a week, about a week ago, with a great enough story to make people think this is actually a next gen title. But after checking our billing statement, we were charged $35 from our offshore account for a bouncing check from Activision. So the review is pending until the issue is fixed. Now, I don't know if they're saying IGN got a bounce check or I don't know if they're saying IGN got a bounce check or maybe Activision paid them to do it. Uh, whatever the case is, um, I honestly don't think people should get paid for reviews. Uh, it, the whole point of a review is for you to let your fans or your, you know, your viewers know what the game is about. Now, I could see you getting the game free or, you know, some posters or, you know, something like that. But um, to get paid to do a review, if you get paid to do a review, while you're getting paid, you're going to be, you're going to kind of be forced. I mean, they're probably not going to force you to tell you, know, you know, you have to say something good about the game. But if someone's paying you, you're going to say something good about the game because you're going to want to get paid for the next one. You, you see what I'm saying? So... Hopefully this isn't the case. Hopefully IGN, or I'm probably reading this wrong. Hopefully they're not doing that, but uh, I really don't care if they do it. But me personally, I just think, how can you trust a review if the person reviewing it is getting paid for it? I can see if they're getting the game for free. And, you know, they give the game a score and be like, hey, this game is perfect. We go get the game because we think, you know, we trust the review. Or they go, the game is horrible. I think you should give people your honest opinion when you're doing a review. But that's just me. Um... It was pretty much saying, you know, so that's pretty much what they were saying. It was, as soon as they get that whole check, as soon as they get the whole bouncing check thing uh, fixed, they're going to bring out the review so we all can see it. Uh, I'm pretty sure they wasn't going to bring this review out anyway until the, you know, the release. But I guess if Activision let them upload it early, I'm guessing that's what they're going to do. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. Let me know in the comments below, do you think it's right for IGN or anyone else to get paid to do a review? Or do you think they should, or do you think they should just get the game? I can understand them getting the game for free. Let me know if they should get the game for free and review it and at least give their honest opinion. What do you guys think in the comments below? And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.